the one-year-old socio-political crisis which has bedeviled the northwest and the southwest regions of Cameroon has remained in the headlines. Of recent, the consortium has demonstrated some signs of weaknesses with the dismissal of its president, Agbobala Felix Congo. The decision contained in a release signed by Tassan Wilfred, John Ba Akuru, amongst others, accuses Bala of having soiled his hands and regretted that he abandoned other consortium members in jail and goes about preaching against a struggle he once championed. According to them, the behavior of the man of law and his recent outings on and beyond the social media does not only speak volumes but lends credence to the fact that he has been compromised. They raised the argument on the fact that Bala's call for school resumption and the boycott of ghost towns of late in an interview in BBC and a local television station portrayed him to be unfit to stand for the people he once represented. It should be indicated here that such outings resulted to enormous damages on Agbobala's personal and family property. The man of law condemned the sufferings and torture the people are being subjected to and advocated for a two-state federation as a way out. According to his point of view, the future of the children of these two regions should not be a mortgage for the social and political reforms highly demanded. The consortium, however, considered the overt utterances of Barista Agbobala Felix Congo as catastrophic and damaging, thereby dishonoring and declaring him a persona non grata and no longer the president of the body that has remained outlawed in Cameroon.